uh, good afternoon everyone this quiz dashboard is available under uh, internal menu internal users option on the quiz website and uh, <coughs> the user id and password is the same which is used for login into rms and tms zonal queries and uh, uh, right now we can log in from zone division and ir so if we are logging in from northern railway this is this is our main page and uh, the most important right now what we have developed for the demonstration purpose is the dynamic query which the user in the normal cases whenever there is uh, a situation where immediate data is needed by the railway board or zonal railways uh, this can be developed and uh, created by the user himself and generated uh, and taken the printout or in the excel format whichever uh, it is needed so in the dynamic query uh, we have this option of generate now button which we click and there are uh, around 10 templates which are present as of now uh, from which uh, slicing and dicing of the data can be done so uh, on the left hand side we have the views which are available for create incentive schemes the dashboard commercial data the operating and data locomotive performance detention wagon turnaround train performance speed interchange and division stock register along with other things so whatever uh, entity we take right for example right now if i just double click on this voice dashboard commercial data the attribute listing is uh, shown here in the uh, below uh, the total listing uh, and this listing basically has two parts the one in the green are the uh, numeric values for example the distance the number of wagons the weight and the freight along with the uh, at different shapes of the freight like freight through e-payment and the entities here starts from the uh, the rrs we can get the minutest details from the RR number, which RRs which were issued from a particular station, to the summarized information like the loading which has happened in two financial years uh, from the various zones and divisions. And we can put the filters on the calendar year, the financial year, then the zone as well as the division, the section, the station, the state, and the district from the originating location as well as or the destination location are shown, which the user has to select. Along with the customer, consigner, consignee details, the commodity which has been loaded, along with the uh, different agreements uh, if for LTTC scheme, uh, the different profiles of the stations, whether we are loading from a powerhouse or we are loading to a powerhouse uh, or steel plant, the cement siding, everything is here so we just i'll show you one as a part of the demo uh, i have to drag and drop in the filters list whatever i need to do so if i click here and drag uh, i can take uh, the two financial years 2021 and 21 22 along uh, with this i will go and uh, take the originating zone i'll take i'll take this financial year and uh, then i'll take the uh, total weight which we can select as uh, in the units of a million tons and then total freight we select as part of the uh, charges so i can execute the query the query also has the options of giving subtotals but right now if we just uh, uh, send it like this so by default 10 entries are shown if i select all the entries i'll get all the financial year wise information the uh, weight and the freight uh, for all the zones and is so, and there are filters down here like if i'll say uh, northern railway then this information can also be filtered uh, there is an option of export here there are multiple export options, PDF, Excel, CSV. Uh, there are options to hide the columns if the user wants that. Uh, I'll just go back to this uh, 
query again. So this is how the dashboard will work. Uh, as far as the commercial dashboard is concerned, uh, we also have developed another feature in commercial, which is the freight incentive schemes. Uh, we, we have multiple schemes which are working right now. So if I select a uh, scheme code uh, and I can select uh, the, the scheme code as uh, long the concession. And then uh, we have this financial year. Uh, we'll take it for two years. Uh, zone wise, uh, we can take information. There are multiple things like the same things which we have shown for the commercial part, uh, the uh, station attributes. Uh, along with the freight information, we can take in uh, crores the freight foregone and the weight which has been loaded. And we execute this data. Uh, so for the uh, long lead concession, uh, year-wise information is shown, uh, and uh, we can see uh, the, the the loading and the freight uh, which we have got. So these are two things. Then next um, are, are for the commercial operating parts. There are many operating reports which we can develop. Uh, starting with the local performance, the terminal detention. Now, Narendra, uh, my teammate will explain to you about this terminal detention. There is terminal detention. We can raise terminal detention up to five years from this report. So I am showing for only yeah, here right now. John, or be John and uh, loading, unloading, and selecting here. Placement to release, release to departure. Arrival to departure. Okay. It is showing the data. 2021, I can filter here, John. Yes, sir. This my entry is loading. Yeah. Placement is in exam, loading, rebooking. This can be detention, arrival to placement, placement to release, release to departure. Placement is in version back. That will be set up loading. This is loading. This is why loading detention of various CRs. We have CRB again. My AC can get the problem. CR card. Right, sir. Another report I want to show you. I can turn around. Financial year by wagon turnaround, we can check off every zone. One year. John WTR.
similar we will show a complex query like a cement siding which is loading for less than 500 km is still charging tfed traditional empty flow direction scheme those kind of data which always we get the request from zone can easily be built on this query with a click of button similarly sir we can calculate the ntkm gtkm from on for last 5 year also so this is how it Division, any traction loaded, empty, and then category, domain, service. So, basically, how much NTKM in million ton, GTKM, million ton, and local GTKM also. This is NTKM, GTKM, and local GTKM of various zones. We can do filter here. And division also. Any division, any division user, zone user, IR user can see the various figure of last five years. Uh, so we can uh, we can we can see that uh, the speeds of, for the various zones, like Central Railway, that last year it was thirty five, now it is uh, forty one kilometers per hour. So similarly, um, uh, these types of analysis can be done through uh, the various options which we have uh, we have shown right now. जी सर सर ये हमने जो स्पीड अभी निकाली है सर दिस इज द टोटल रिक्स व्हिच फ्रेट ट्रेन्स व्हिच हैव रन इन दिस फाइनेंशियल ईयर 2021-2022 अलोंग विद द एवरेज स्पीड्स ऑफ दिस इसमें सर रेक टाइप का हमारे पास चेक है सो वी कैन अप्लाई दैट चेक ऑफ रेक टाइप टू so, sir, these are the options which we have. Uh, these are the uh, ad hoc queries which we have developed up till now. So that's it from our side, sir. The 50 least performers yesterday. This may need to filter like us. You have to have speed color as a top five greater than five is the record.
This is the monitoring of CC rigs. The total number of CC rigs owned by Northern Railway are 195, and whose expiry 84 has been done, and 16 are due, sir. Uh, similarly, uh, uh, for the various other uh, zones, sir, along with the holding figures on the right hand side, sir. So it will give you the details of all the CCs which have expired. Yeah, yes. So we can see which which are the CCs which are expired and where they are running. Over you CCs. Uh, there is this option of KPI dashboard when the user clicks on this, uh, specifically the senior DOMs when they are on their way for inspections and the locations. Uh, there are uh, many KPIs which he can monitor as part of the red flags. Like uh, uh, there are uh, seven rigs which are awaiting placement and uh, for more than one hour. Similarly, uh, there are 105 rigs which are awaiting release, and uh, 53 are under lo are uh, loading. Similarly, 41 locos are awaiting loco, and uh, stable loads. There are 16 stable loads which are more than 24 hours, yes. and there are details of these 26 which are uh, waiting for more than eight hours. Sir, so rate position, these are 106 uh, loads for outward, but which were not forecasted. So, uh, this is the uh, interchange position. 98 loads are yet to be interchanged, and 109 which have been forecasted. And the 17 lakes which have interchanged were not forecasted in the system. This is northern uh, position, uh, handing over position. Then taking over, yeah. May, total 133 lakes are there. Out of which 129 were forecasted, four were not forecasted. 117 loads are yet to be interchanged. Well, take on over by Northern Railway. Uh, sir, there is a small icon uh, here which says Add to Favorite. So you just have to click here, yeah. and uh, there is a you can create uh, two uh, multiple type of favorites. So one is the default, and one which we have created is the operating. So if I select operating and save this. Uh, so the next time when I will log in, it will be part of my uh, favorites uh, window, sir. Uh, after that is the examination, CC rate examinations, uh, which are due and overdue, premium, others, and end route TXR examinations. Details are here, sir. Uh, and these local details are there, sir. How many local details? Uh, local holding. Diesel uh, local holding, electric local holding. The 23 locos are working as normal, others uh, 267, uh, their overalling is due, sir. And then last is the commercial one, which is uh, having the details of the pending RRs, uh, the divergence, the commercial and the operating, uh, the earnings which have been earned, the terminal handling, uh, the wrong reporting which has been done. Uh, 382 cases and similarly the out, uh, ODR wise outstanding the mature indents and the tonnage. So this is the snapshot of the com commercial parts. Level.